Hello everybody, I am the Black Sigma, or you could just call me Eric. And welcome back to Metal Gear 2 Inside the Zanzibar Building. Where apparently... Oh, well that sucks. But luckily this room cancels a lot. Apparently on the east side of the building there is a hang glider which will get us across the crevice, which we will need in order to... Hey, blue card. Nice. Four through six. Uh, anyway, as I was saying, on the east side of this building is the hang glider, which will need to cross the crevice in order to, well, find Grey Fox, save Madna, destroy Metal Gear. Huh. It's another mannequin room. It definitely helps to have my radar for this so I can see what's fake and what isn't. Got him. They really put one guard in front of the hang glider. And... There's probably some other stuff to do in this building too, now that I think of it. There's gotta be something else I can do before going to a... hang glider across the gap. Uh-oh. You didn't see anything. Apparently you saw everything. Well, good good alert status, guys. You really you really you really showed me. There's a basement, too. I... don't... wait, basement 2... Okay, basement 2 is the waterway. Then basement 1 is the one with some doors I haven't opened. Like... Uh, this is just ammo. Oh, come on! You barely saw that, man. But this door, I couldn't get through here earlier. And that means I can check this. Grenades. Okay. I can check this. A mouse and O2 tank. Doubles the length and slows the depletion of the O2 gauge when underwater. That's gonna come in handy. And evasion over. And this door... Gas grenades. Still don't really know the use for those. There's also a door beyond that security camera, beyond three of the wires that slow me down. It's a nice little trick you got here. Oops. 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 Just go, snake. A camouflage mat. Interesting. There's some other stuff to the right I also couldn't get to previously, if I remember correctly. Like, one of these doors definitely didn't open before. This wouldn't be one of them, because it clearly did just open. And good evasion, Snake. Really showed your skill as a stealth operative. Grenades. 
this door. No. Yes. RC missiles. And this door opens. Hey, stingers. I can blow up people on other squares again. Cool. Oh, I did not know that trapdoor was there. I am getting so lucky avoiding traps. But body armor. Finally. So useful. It halves damage from bullets. Which is gonna be great in me getting the hell out of here now that I've cleared out this basement, finally. Back on the fourth floor. Surely there were doors I missed up here. I am pretty sure there are. I don't remember which doors, but I'm sure there are some. Oh, the doors on the right here. I definitely couldn't use these earlier. Okie dokie. Oh, come on, man. You had to turn at that moment. I just wanted to check this door before I continued the way that was clearly progress. Wanna know a secret? You know Gustava's brooch? It changes shape when you put it in the sauna or the freezer. Oh, uh, hello. Ah, uh, you found me, I was playing hide and seek. Huh, so I can physically go inside some of these... I guess these are lockers, but they've got like, whole rooms inside them. Also, I see. The... These floors make noise. And being an infirmary with sleeping guards, they'll wake up and attack me if I make noise. Good thing I know how to crawl. And crawling does not make noise. Uh-oh. It was card... red card. I'm just gonna quickly chuck on my night vision. Ah, seems like this floor doesn't make noise. But if I turned on the lights, it'd definitely wake those guards up. And... Hey, cold medicine. Just in case. And there should be a door down here somewhere. It's not blue card, it's red card. The sauna. Huh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I mean, what's that guy gonna do? Shoot me? He's naked. Mostly naked. But... Gustavus brooch. It's shaped like a key all of a sudden. Huh. I wonder if I can take it quickly enough to whatever it's needed to unlock. Now, I have a funny feeling what it's needed to unlock was one of the lockers. A cassette tape found in Gustavus locker contains a recording of the national anthem which forces the guards to stand at attention. I better not overuse that. You know how finicky cassettes can be. Oh, right. The, the veranda for hang gliding wasn't on the roof. It was through this elevator, which goes to floor 20 which I hadn't actually been to, because I'm dumb. Stopped on floor 19? 
What? If only I had expected this because I've played the game, like, once before. Snake. Snake, it's me, Grey Fox. Fox. You should have listened to my warning, Snake. Now I'm afraid our friendship is at an end. That elevator is going to be your tomb. What? Do you hear that sound? That's an assassination team. They specialize in confined spaces. I'm sure you'll put up a good fight. I have an SMG and body armor. The ceiling! It was nice talking to you one last time, Snake. Over and out. We are the Four Horsemen, a top-secret assassination squad. We get our orders directly from the President. The President of Zanzibar Land, I presume? Not the US? Consider this an honor. We only fry the big fish. Well, this subby is, uh... Way slower than the last game's subby. Just trying to keep an eye on my health, so... You know, just in case I still end up taking too much damage, despite being in body armor, I can pull out a ration when need be. Oh, that guy was in the ceiling. Okay, it's ration time. Ration time, snake. Uh, that one, because I have more of it. And back to body armor. I'm pretty sure these guys all have individual health, too. Uh, maybe not. The pitch of the, uh, damage sound changes depending on how hurt someone is. So maybe I'm doing enough to them. Oh, that one's red. No, they're individual health. Because one's red and the others aren't. Damn it. Oh, he's dead. Still. Means that I have a lot left to do to the remaining guys. I'll equip another ration. And... Hmm... Crowd suppression... Do not use downwind of target... Camouflage mat... Oh, it's portable hiding space. But... If I... Drop mines... On their path... Yeah, that's gonna make this a whole lot easier. <laughs> Drop the mine right in front of that guy, that's absurd. Another one bites the dust. Ow. I need to stop being in range of my own explosives. And final guy taken care of. Rewarding me with card 7. But the elevator dropped all the way to the ground. Uh-oh. Guess I'll have to find another way to reach floor 20. But... Hmm, the inside elevator only goes up to... 30. Meaning my best bet is, uh... The outside elevator goes up to, what, the 10th floor? Maybe there's a staircase I missed or some sh Actually, no, I think that's right. Yeah, because it's like the Shadow Moses staircase. If you hadn't gathered by now, they call MGS2 the Solid Snake Simulation because Raiden is going through the events of Shadow Moses, effectively. But the events of Shadow Moses 
really just parallel the first two Metal Gear games. It's the Solid Snake simulation for Snake himself. Floor 10. There's gotta be a way up. That elevator's dead. I've gone through those hallways. Oh, this bottom door didn't open with... Uh... This, this bottom door didn't open with, like, card 4 or 5. Opens with card 7. Good to know. Oh, hello. But yes. Ambush on the staircase. It's really... This is really just foreshadowing Moses. Shadow Moses, not, you know, the coming of Moses, the guy who parted the sea. But we're in permanent, permanent alert status. Guards following us all the way up. We've got to run up ten floors. I haven't jogged upstairs in like... Ten years. Oh god. Why am I a special ops agent if I can't handle a staircase? Damn it, they're putting tripwires to slow me down. <sighs> hey, ammo. Nice. Anyway, we're on... what is it? 18 now? 17. Jeez. Okay, next one is 18. Oop. Trap in the middle of the floor. Don't worry about it. Just start cutting corners. 18. And... 19. Just one more floor, Snake. Then we can glide over that crevice to take on Grey Fox. Ooh, ammo. Floor 20, baby. And a door. Uh, which card? Seven? Yeah, baby. Cool. Oh. And the alert's gone. Nice. Hello, kid. One-eyed man's like your daddy. He doesn't like grown-ups. Noted. I mean, I'm pretty sure I already went over that. But also, yes, the tripwires that are hard to walk past make noise. But I'm gonna finish exploring this floor before I, you know, uh, glide anywhere. Good news, there was like nothing on this floor. Call. It's me, your number one fan. You can only jump from there when the wind's blowing north. Usually blows uh, one way, but you can tell when it's blowing north via certain means. Uh oh. That was not a good text box to skip. Accidentally. I should be able to use gas grenades to figure it out. I've used nearly all of my gas grenades. Well... Smoking doesn't help me either. It's... it's north, now. Go, Snake, go! Go! Whew. I used literally all of my gas grenades. And if it changed, like, the second after I saw that north... Come on. 
You can make it, Snake. Yes! Ooh. Crevasse crossed. Point of no return. Uh-oh. We've, we've landed fine, right, Snake? Yeah! We're here! Woo. Now... I've... I'm gonna... Oh! Can't carry anymore. Right, I should probably equip things. That'd be useful. Keep an eye on the radar so I don't walk out while those guys are clearly patrolling around this truck. You two gonna move? Yeah, there they go. And quick, punch, 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 punch. Check this truck. A gas grenade to replace that one I wasted. A B1 ration. I don't remember which side of this cliff I entered this base from. It might be this one. But I don't trust that. Oh, and the point of no return isn't actually a point of no return. You can use these conveyor belts to mail yourself to other places. Card 7 on the left hand side gets me in the building, but I didn't fully explore the right. Huh, so the right side also leads to a way in, but to a different area, I guess? Hmm, they can't enter that building. I see they have some kind of laser defense grid. I'm fairly certain the power supply for the defense grid is, uh... The, the power supply would be what's through that left-hand gate. So I have to turn off the power before I come back here. Got it. In that case, I will head through this gate. In the next episode. Bye.